tutorial, we're going to do a very short tutorial, actually. We're going to fix something that uh, I forgot to point out in previous tutorials. Um, we need to fix this before we move on to our next set of tutorials, which is going to be working with categories with our post. So let's go ahead and take a look at what our issue is. Um, currently, on our blog page that, posts, that has a list of all our posts, we are actually posting um, everything from drafted to published. Um, draft draft posts that are set, their status is set to draft, should not be displayed on the front page, all right? Um, but currently they are. Uh, so is published. Publish is what we want to be seen by the users, but right now they're seeing all of them. So um, right here, if you see, this is my, this one's set to draft, um, and one of these is set to published. If I go back in my thing here, I got Tom is set to publish. That should be the only one we're seeing here, okay? So what is the issue? Well, the issue uh, comes up in our uh, views.py file. And right here, where we query the database, we're saying post.objects.all. All right, so return all. We're not giving an um, argument in there saying, hey, we only want this one or this one. So we're saying post.objects.all, we want all the posts, all right? So we want to go ahead and kind of get rid of all the posts and filter it so we can just return the published post because that's all we want the user to see. So how do we do that? Well, simple. We do filter, all right? And then inside filter, we're gonna give an argument. And if you remember correctly, in our models.py file, we have status as our variable that's holding our char field, which is holding our status choices, which are draft and published, okay? So we want to be able to say if status is set equal to publish, the value right here, which is lowercase, the left side is the value, the right side is human readable. Um, if it's set to publish, then we want to display that, okay? So how do we do that? We just simply do status equal and then a string published, okay? Go ahead and save that. Go back to your browser. Um, if you haven't set one to draft or published, you might want to do that first. Otherwise, you're going to get confused. So I got uh, a couple set to draft and one set to publish. So I should only see one post. So I'll go ahead and refresh. And the post I should see is Tom. And there we go. All right, so we're, we're displaying the published post. So that was just an easy fix for today's tutorial. Um, in the next tutorial, we're going to add categories to our post. And figure out how that all works and how we incorporate uh, other models into each other. Even though we did see that with authors a little bit, we're going to dig a little bit deeper. If you have any questions, leave a comment on YouTube. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like the video. We'll see